Biotic Component All living organisms of a pond ecosystem include the biotic component. It shows various types of living organisms. They are producers, consumers and decomposers. The organisms which can prepare their own food in pond ecosystem are called producers. They utilize the sun's energy directly with the help of chlorophyll and synthesize the organic compounds. In pond ecosystem, producers are of two types, namely a. Large plants growing along the bank of floating in shallow water b. Tiny microscopic floating plants scattered throughout water as far down as light can penetrate. The minute floating plants are collectively called the phytoplanktons. The phytoplanktons are more important as the food producers for the pond ecosystem than the large plants. They include phytoplankton, some algae and floating submerged and marginal plants found at the edges. Consumers are organisms that utilize the food produced by the green plants. They include crustaceans, worms, insects, fishes, etc. Decomposers. They include fungi, bacteria, flagellates, especially abundant in the bottom of the pond. These organisms decompose the dead bodies of plants and animals. They convert dead complex organic materials into simple inorganic materials. These simple inorganic materials are again absorbed by producers to prepare food materials. Functions of the pond ecosystem The solar input, the cycle of temperature, day length and other climatic conditions regulate the rate of functions of the entire pond. Conversion of inorganic into organic material with the help of the radiant energy of the sun by the autotrophs. Consumption of the autotrophs by heterotrophs. Decomposition and mineralization of the dead matter to release them back for reuse by the autotrophs. These events are repeated over and over again. There is unidirectional movement towards the higher trophic levels and its dissipation and loss as heat to the environment. The components of the ecosystem are seen to function as a unit when you consider the following aspects. They are a. Productivity b. Decomposition c. Energy flow and d. Nutrient cycling.